everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Destiny, you can call me Future Nurse Destiny. And in today's video, I'm gonna be giving you guys a huge supply haul and a giveaway. If you are interested in any of the items that I mentioned today, you can check the link in the description box below. This video will be split up into sections, so if you are interested in a specific section of school supplies, you can look in the description box down below for those timestamps. A quick disclaimer and feedback from my previous school supply haul, and I just wanna let you guys know that as a nursing student, you are not required to have majority of the things that I'm going to be showing you in today's video. I am extremely grateful and blessed to be able to have all of these things for a brand new school year and so I just want to put that out there. These are things that I have received from people but also things that I have purchased on my own and again I am just really grateful and blessed to be able to do that. So last year my theme was kind of like navy blue and hot pink with white of course. This year I'm going for black and white with kind of the same Dalmatian print. I just really like this print. I think that it is so trendy and new right now and I think it just looks so good on some of the school supplies that I got. So I hope you enjoy this video and let's go ahead and get started. All right, so first of all, we're gonna start out with uniforms and shoes. So my school did not require us to purchase the new uniforms. However, they did go with new uniforms this year and the junior class was required to order the new ones. And the seniors had the option to. A lot of us seniors did because they are the Cherokee workwear and they are extremely way more comfortable than our previous Meredith's ones. The Meredith's ones just were a different fabric, so they weren't as comfortable really. So I did order two sets of the new scrubs. Like I said, these are the Cherokee workwear. This is the style WW110 in the color navy and I ordered the extra extra smalls. They have a side pocket on the pants as well as the normal pockets here and one pocket on the bum and it also has the elastic waistband which is just so comfortable. So I got two pairs of pants and I got two tops as well. Same material. They're so comfortable and really just airy which is a lot different than what we used to have. They also went with a new seal design on the rocket instead of doing the side design where we have the inserts and if you have no idea what I'm talking about you guys can go check out my first nursing school supply haul for my first year of nursing school and these are the size extra small so although I love my nursemaids I had to hop on the bandwagon and pick up some clothes so I do have the white clothes for this school year I've already tried them on a little bit and they are pretty comfortable I do think I'm gonna like my nursemaids a little bit better for the way that my arch is the nursemaids kind of support my arch a little bit better but we're gonna try these out and see what we think because I would love to be a supporter of cloves for the rest of time. So I picked up these white cloves. All right, so next up we are going to be talking about bags. So first up is my backpack for school. This is the Maiden backpack. This is the same exact one I had last year. It is the rolling backpack. I just got it in the color black to match my theme. So again, it is just a rolling backpack. It has the tall handle so that you can walk with it and it has the wheels on the bottom. So this is my backpack for this year. The brand Yapito purse reached out to me and wanted to send me this massive purse. It is really, really big, but it fits a lot of things and it's going to be, for me, I'm going to be using it so that whenever I take trips to the library or to Starbucks or whatever, I can just throw in a couple of the things that I'm working on and use this. This is my new clinical bag this year. I love this thing. The fabric almost reminds me of like Lululemon, like some of the bags that they have. So I'm really excited. It has tons and tons of pockets. It's super spacious. It's big enough. It doesn't necessarily have a water bottle pocket, but it does have a zipper pouch so you can try to put something in there. If you guys are interested in a new what's in my backpack or what's in my clinical bag video let me know down in the comments next up is my new pencil case I'm sure that you guys have seen this on Amazon or any other school supply before but it just has three dividers so that you can organize your school supplies next up is my lunch box I picked up this one from Amazon and it genuinely just fits my theme perfectly and I am just super excited to use it this year because I'm gonna be having classes pretty much throughout the entire day so I'm gonna have to pack a lunch for my Wednesday Thursday classes and last in this section I am super super excited to share with you guys my new stethoscope case this is absolutely adorable I don't mind the stethoscope cases that are on Amazon that have the stethoscopes on it and things like that I was just trying to grow and expand and just kind of formalize a lot of my school supplies this year so I found this one from Bajorn Hall it is just this nice almost clutch looking stethoscope case it fits exactly what you need your stethoscope will fit in here as well as pin lights you can put a pulse socks in here. The inside is kind of felted so it's definitely protective and it has a magnetic closure. So it just looks like this and I think that this is just so cute. And that is all for this section.
So in this section, I will be talking about water bottles and lunch supplies. So first of all, you guys know I love Hydro Drug. It is one of the brands that I have just grown to enjoy and kind of collect at this point. So I'm gonna be putting in a clip here to show you guys my updated collection and all of the things that I have. They have a new release coming out today, so I will be purchasing a new jug and sleeve that will add on to my collection. But I wanted to include that as well because Hydro Drug is something that is important to me. And of course, I wanna share that with you guys as well. All right, so because I changed up my theme this year and colors I had to get some new simple modern water bottles so I have a white one I believe this is the 16 ounce bottle this is the 18 ounce summit and I have that in white and black these are the rubber boots again just like I said in my first school supply haul I recommend getting these for your water bottles because if you're in class and you're making a little clang clang someone's gonna come and look at you and just make you feel awkward so you guys can mix and match these as well which like I said is one of the things that I really like about simple modern next up I love these reusable Starbucks cups and and of course I picked up this one from Etsy and it just matches my theme perfectly so I will leave the seller's information down below. All right and I already showed you guys my lunch box but I want to show you my lunch boxes that I got to fit inside. So first of all I just got these little sauce salad dressing containers. I believe I got these from the dollar store so I just picked up a couple of these and of course those will fit really well just right inside my lunch box. And for the actual boxes this year I went with the company Bent Go. I found these on Amazon so I got three different styles so this first one is like a genuine bento box. So it has this little strap, has an open top and a separate container there. All right, and next up is this other bento container. This one is kind of like a salad container. So it has this part that comes up and you can get a fork. It opens into this divided container. It has a little dressing container as well. And then you open it up to the big container. I'll probably use this for salads to be healthy. And of course it fits in here as well. And the last of my lunch containers is this one. This is Bent Go as well. It has this pull tab so you just lift up and it has a fork and spoon. And then it twists off and opens up and this one is like a thermal container so it'll keep soups and pastas warm. It also has a little vent as well. So I am really excited to be packing my lunch in these this semester. So that is it for this section. So next up, we will be talking about my stethoscopes. So this one was actually purchased kind of on accident. Last year when I was in clinicals, I lost my pink one. So I had to quickly Amazon Prime a new one, which eventually was found. I had a combative patient, so we were taking off our stethoscopes and setting them down. And as we were leaving that room, I just completely forgot to pick it back up. So I picked up this black one. This is the Lipman Classic 3. And of course, I love my Lipmans. It just fits really well in the neck. The tubing is really nice. And now I have a extra backup. So as I mentioned, Bijor and Hall, I reached out to them and wanted this stethoscope case and they were nice enough to send me a stethoscope case as well as a white stethoscope, which just matches my theme so perfectly, guys. This is the Bijorn stethoscope. It is very, very comparable and similar to the Litmans. The price is a little bit cheaper, so that is nice as well if you're looking for a quality stethoscope with a similar but not as expensive price tag. It is dual head. One thing that I'm waiting on from her is a diaphragm, so I will put a picture right here to show you guys what it's going to look like, but it says as nursing student and it has an S. I do really like this stethoscope. Let me show you guys what it looks like in the case. So you just slide it right on in there, close it up, and it just stays nice and compact. And that's what it looks like. It is super sleek and I just really love this case. One thing that I also really appreciate from Bijorn Hall is they include this little case and it just comes with little replacement earpieces and replaceable um, diaphragms as well. So that is all for the stethoscope portion. So next up, I'm going to be talking about electronics. So this year I didn't get any new electronics since my previous school supply haul. So the only thing that has been updated is my new iPhone 12. But the things that I want to show you in this clip is just my new cases for them. So this is my new phone case. This is from Amazon. And of course, just like I said, everything will be linked down below. I also have a new stethoscope. <laughs> <laughs> this is my new Apple Watch band. This is from Coconut Lane. It is just super cute and of course it matches my phone case. You guys may have seen this in your local Target, but I got this from the dollar section. It is a mouse pad and we've been needing a new one for my iMac, so I picked this one up. And it also has this wireless charging spot for your phone and it just has a little plug-in for you to plug in the cord. Again, I did not get a new iPad by any means, um, but I did get a new case. So this one is black and it just has the nice little foldable part so you can set it up and my apple pencil is the same as well well 
technically this is my third apple pencil because the first one got chewed up accidentally by my roommate's dog she replaced it and then that one the top part got messed up so this is my third apple pencil and this is going to be its new home so this is my new ipad case and again i did not get a new macbook this year but this is my macbook air 13 inch and this is my new case so this is a white case and i just ordered a ton of stickers on redbubble and just did sort of this nursing collage so that is what that looks like and that is all for this section Next, I'm gonna be talking about my books. Now, I know this isn't the most fun section, but I just wanna include it just for mem for myself, but also because I love hearing you guys say that you guys have the same textbooks as well. So this semester, I am taking community nursing, OBPEDS, and MedSearch too. So this is my community nursing book. That's pretty much it. <laughs> this is my OBPEDS book pretty much it. And this is my MedSurge 2 book, which also functioned as my MedSurge 1 book and will also function next semester for my critical care class. So I'm also just going to include my planner in this section because it's technically a book. So this is my brand new planner for this year. This is the Hourly Layout Life Planner. Um, and if you haven't seen any of my plan with me videos, make sure you follow me on Instagram at Future Nurse Destiny. But I also have one or two posted here on my YouTube channel. So you can check that out. And I was just going to show you guys my little sticker box as well. These are all planner stickers. I got this pencil case from Target and it fits and holds all of my stickers perfectly. I just wanted to include these in this little section as well. So last but not least, this is just going to be a huge compilation of just a bunch of miscellaneous type of school supplies. So I'm just going to start picking stuff up and just showing you as we go. So first I already showed you guys my pencil case, but I want to show you guys what's inside. So this is going to be going with me pretty much everywhere I go, whether that be in my school backpack or if I use my Yapito purse for Starbucks or what have you, this is going to go with me. So of course I need all these supplies to keep me sane. So first of all, in this pack, I just have all of my Clearview highlighters. I also have a, two of my big chunky highlighters because you guys know I like using these for um, highlighting my textbook. In this other side one, there are two little mesh pockets. So I have a high polymer eraser in here. I also have some post-it notes just in case. And I have a little set of purple sticky flags and just a couple more little band-aids left as well. Just to clarify, these are band-aid sticky notes. I also have a little pair of baby tweezers in here because you never know when you have that spare eyebrow hair but um, no, because I've been using them for my planner stickers. Some of my planner stickers are really tiny. So these help me pick it up and place it. So I have these in here as well. I also have a mini whiteout because sometimes you make mistakes and you gotta have some whiteout. This is the Ultra Fine Point Sharpie. I also have my favorite big mechanical pencils. I don't really use mechanical pencils anymore, but these are still my favorite. They are the big velocity. So I've got purple and I've also got green. Of course, I have to have my Sharpie S-Gel pens. This is the white one. And I'm missing my black one. I don't know where it's at at the moment, but these are the wet erase markers by Erin Condren. Oh, I didn't know there was another pocket in here. I didn't know there was a pocket. Wow, learn something new every day. All right, and last in this big pocket, I won't pull everything out. Oh. There's the other one. I won't pull everything out because it's just a bunch of different colors of stuff, but I have a whole pack of the Friction Erasable Pins. These are my favorite erasable pins. I tried the Parku brand from Amazon last year and they just ran out of ink too quick for me. The ink wasn't super saturated, so I went with the better brand um, in my opinion, which is the Friction brand. So I got the regular um, ballpoint pins and I also got the Friction Fine Liner Erasable Markers. So one thing that I would have hoped is that these would be a little bit thicker because how fine these are is pretty much the exact as this. You can slightly tell a difference when I use one or the other, but not really. So I've got those in here of all different colors. So this is going to be traveling with me everywhere I go for school. On the other hand, this is just a pencil cup that sits on my desk. So I believe this cup is from Hobby Lobby. I got these scissors from Target. They're just little black and white ones. Of course, I've got my Sharpie Clearview highlighters in here. I've got my big boys in here. These these are the Clearview Sharpie ones. These are the short and thick is what I'm going to call them. I've got a couple of Sharpies in here. That's a big one. And then my ultra fine one. Got a wet erase in here. I've got tons of different colors of the friction erasable pens. I've got a couple of mechanical pencils in here. A couple of my Sharpie S gel pens as well. I picked up a huge pack of these Bic round stick medium pens. I don't know. These are some of my favorite just use and toss pens. I just keep this big pack in my clinical bag in case anyone needs to 
to borrow a pin or in case I just forget my pins that day and just need a pick me up. With my clove purchase, I also got these pins and they're just little click pins. Anyway, so these say for borrowing only. So these are just um, for borrow pins or for borrowing for myself, you know? I also have, a, I literally have a bunch of these pretty much everywhere, but again, the friction erasable pens in black ink, these are great if you're allowed to use them for clinical paperwork or anything like that, because if you write a lab value down and you accidentally wrote it down in the wrong spot or something, quick erase, rewrite it, and you're good to go. Wouldn't be a future nurse destiny haul if I didn't include some post-it tabs, so these are the tabs, same exact ones that I usually pick up, but I just wanted to show you guys these as well before I use them for my new textbooks this year. This year, I picked up some of these mini post-it tabs in all of these different colors. I just thought maybe I could use these to mark my days in my planner. If you guys have watched any of my planner videos, you've seen me do that. But also just for reading as well. I usually like to tab where I need to start reading and end reading. That way I have some motivation to finish. So I picked up these. Next up is my new pencil pouch. This one is black. I got this chapstick holder from Etsy. I'll leave the seller below. I also got some new black bandage scissors and nothing else is really different. I do have my friction erasable pins in here and some pen lights and just an extra little chopstick too and some hemostats. So I got this little basket from Hobby Lobby and this year I'm just keeping all of my badge reels in here so let me pull out my new ones. So first of all I've had this little hippo forever. My grandma works in healthcare so she gave it to me when I was very very little but this I think I'm going to use for pediatrics. It can just wrap around. It has magnetic hands. It can wrap around your stethoscope so I think I'm going to use this for my pediatric rotation to go with kind of the black and white theme I picked up these two sparkly ones for when I get around wedding week um next January I wanted to pick up this little diamond one just so that I could wear it and just be fun and lastly because I got clothes and then I got replacements because I needed a smaller size I got two sets of the clove badge reels so got two sets of these and that is all the badge reels that I got this year I'm actually proud of myself because I did not get more all right I picked up these list pads from Target I really like these list pads this one is just big and plain. This one is just medium and plain and this one has kind of a um, hourly schedule spot and then also a to-do spot and then you could just mark the day of the week. So I really like these. I also picked up this tri-fold folder and I have already labeled it for my classes but this is just going to go in my backpack so whenever I get any kind of loose leaf papers I can put them in here during class and then when I get home I can sort it in its respective binder. I picked up this at Target in the dollar section. Try to turn it so it doesn't give too much glare. You just put any kind of practice thing inside of here. You can write on it with an erasable marker um, to kind of like check yourself. I loved using something similar to this for anatomy and I do the same for dosage calc and I will also do the same for memorizing lab values. So this is super cool to have and I got it at Target. All right, we're down to the last few items. So first of all, I have these two little van pad is the brand little pocket notebooks. I like using these for clinical because if my nurse tells me something or my instructor tells me something, I will just quickly write that in here, close it up, stick it in my pocket. They fit perfectly and I just picked up a couple of black ones. This is a foldable clipboard. This is just a plain one. It did come with the nursing back but I did not stick that on there. I've kind of just been using this as a sticker collection book type of thing. I got my Travel Nurses Incorporated stickers on here. I've got my Susie B Fit stickers on here. I've got a Catan sticker on here. I've got Cincy stickers on here and then all of my extra stickers from my laptop are on here and then I've got like my school mascot sticker on here. So this is just my new collection spot for stickers just to make it a little bit more fun. All right, and I couldn't have picked a better last supply to show you guys for the school supply haul because I just love it so much. Of course, this is the print and theme for my school year this year. It is this Dalmatian print. This is a, it's not a foldable clipboard. It's just a regular clipboard. So it has the clip here and it also opens up into a list pad with a pocket. It has a pin slot as well. All right, and now for the giveaway. So I am super excited to be giving you guys away some really awesome goodies. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take you through this little basket that I have so that you guys know what you're playing for. So first up, got these list pads at Target and I just think that they're great for productivity. So I'm including these for you. Also, you will be receiving 200 sheets of college ruled paper. Obviously you need paper as a student. So I'm just including this for you guys. I also have a pack of post-it notes. I had to include some of my favorite utensils. So I have a ultra fine sharpie here. Also got the erasable friction pens and the sharpie highlighters with the see-through um, clear view part. And of course this wouldn't be a future nurse destiny giveaway if I didn't include some tabs for you guys to tab your books. So these are going to be included as well. And I have a 
Casio watch. Brand new. This is just like my one that I had last year. I know that some nursing schools won't let you do Apple watches, so I wanted to include this for you guys as well. And I've got um, some of my favorite little flashcards. These are the mini ones that have the little rings so that you can create your own study sets. So I will be including this too. All right, so that is the giveaway. Just kidding, guys. I have a couple more items I wanted to include as the grand finale. So first of all, I have this Hydro Jug. Of course, you guys know I love Hydro Jug. This is a special edition firecracker color, and you'll be receiving this in the giveaway box. And last but certainly not least, you guys are going to be receiving a Erin Condren Academic Planner. This is their brand new one that they just released, as well as an Erin Condren discount code and a Planner Kate discount code as well. So if you guys are interested in winning all of these goodies, you will have two different opportunities. So first, of course, is here on my YouTube channel, and second will be posted on my Instagram page. So make sure that you do both of those if you want any of these goodies in here. So since you're watching on my YouTube channel, all that I'm going to ask is that you subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment down below what your favorite school supply is. In doing so, you will be entered to win this huge goodie box. And if you want to enter the giveaway on my Instagram, I will have the detail listed there. I hope you guys love this giveaway. I have been planning this all summer long, and I think that these are some really awesome items to get you guys going for the beginning of the school year. All right, so this giveaway will be closed August 30th, so make sure that you go and do all of those things so that you can be entered to win this giveaway. And yeah, I'm excited to send this to one lucky winner. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. This is by far my favorite video to film for you guys is a school supply haul. And unfortunately, but fortunately, this is going to be my last one. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here and make sure you enter that giveaway. So with that, I hope you guys have an awesome day and I will see you in the next video.